Hello everyone, and welcome to Game Time Kit, where sometimes we play randomizers. And today it's the Wind Waker randomizer. I do that to tell the difference between different save files for the random. Wonderful. I'm starting out with bombs because, well, I don't particularly fancy being gated out of everything at the moment. But yeah, no, I've been, I did a practice run where I, where I just played the main game and yeah, no, I, I played the base game and then I um, played a rando feed of my own. Yeah, no, this is pretty much just randomised as it's getting. Aside from, like, the keys, which I really can't be able to go and hunt for. The red fairies in this game are so weird. Nothing else that, uh. We'll have to go to Windfall. Figured that'd be the case. More heart contains you with more life. Yay. Fifty rupees. Okay. But yeah, no, I've been, um, I've been playing a lot of Wind Waker the last couple of days because, like, I need something different to play. Uh, yeah, okay, uh, obviously we use the Swiss sale. We're gonna get a lot of that. Uh... 
for the any of them. Yeah, no, there's a lot to do on um on dragon roofs, realistically. chart actually is helpful. It means I can handle those. We're gonna have to do Floosh Kaboom and the postal mini game. Neither of which I particularly wanna do, but like hey what can you do? There's literally no choice in that. Um Cause I, I like to add to the pool like I like to add to the potential item locations. Yeah, no, the combat in Wind Waker is some of my favourite in the Zelda franchise. I will be doing a ranking of all my favourite, like, of all the Zelda games, by the way. At some point. jelly and we need to collect um, all sorts to be honest we need to collect school pendants we need to collect um, joy pendants we need to collect golden feathers At least this is mounting up the money I can use for Sploosh Kaboom. Uh, we need to do Sploosh Kaboom twice, once getting the high score. Like, once getting over the high score, once getting the exact high score. Or lower. Wait. We need to... Oh. 
Never know when I'm gonna need it. I'm a dumbass. I'm embarrassed about that. Not gonna lie. Funny story, that um chest that was above the rock that I had to shoot down when I first got to the island, you can get that with a high repair. You don't actually have to wait for a bow or bombs or any of that shite. It is likely what most kids would have done when they first started out the game. This is where the fun begins. I, of course, mean that in every sarcastic way I can. Yeah, no, I'm already fucking it up. Kind of makes me feel sick. I don't know. That was pitiful. I wouldn't mind if it wasn't for the unacceptable, like...
This is ridiculous. This isn't acceptable to buy this control stick is reading my inputs. To what I recall, it's no easier on an actual GameCube. Why? Oh, this is ridiculous. Ridiculous. This is this mini game is one of the worst things about Wind Waker. Fuck off. I get really bad RNG on this as well. I expect it to do better. I expect it to be nicer. This isn't a matter of being easy or hard. This is a matter of being like way too hard to process in time. Like, my brain doesn't move fast enough for this. I actually do believe that this is a bad mini game. Like, the moment you lock a reward behind this shit, it becomes too much. Ridiculous. Honestly. I could complain about this all day. I don't have close speed running reflexes. This is terrible. This is an awful, awful mini game. Ow.
Oh, thank God. Now we just have to do that a second fucking time because apparently it wasn't enough. Can I just do it once? I actually do think that this is a failure, like this mini game. Like, it does piss me off on a level that I can't even explain. Okay, I have a free file rule, one that I don't follow when I'm playing games, but basically, your average player should be able to conquer most challenges within three tries of doing it. I'm more than just your average player, I'm, I'm not a professional Zelda player, but like, I'm good at these games. Also, I just don't think mini games are pure reflex in a game that otherwise isn't about that. Are actually a good thing. But, you know. I hope whoever made this minigame feels really bad about themselves and has apologised to at least five people over making such a fatal error in game design. I will say, the minigames are one of the worst parts of this game. 
Uh, don't get me wrong, I ain't that fond of the treasure chest minigame in um, Majora. Okay, that's that done. We never have to do shit again. And we've got a trifle shard for it. And we'll get a letter from his mother. I'm not going to do Dragon Ruth Cavern right now. Because it'll be most of the keys. And honestly, I don't feel like dealing with that right now. Okay. We'll take we'll take the walk to the fairy isle. We're at our half hour point right now. I won't say that this has to be a specific length, this video. Something that I do often forget about is the um is Jaboon's cave at the back of Windfall. I won't because I don't have the core at least. I want to do that all in, all in one. Okay, so the current plan is to is to handle the island. Like one thing I will say, we need to be careful of big octos. We can't fight those apart from the great fairy one that's near the reef. Okay. 
still don't think we needed the cutscenes to show them. Just made my life more difficult. Treasure chart one. Yeah, treasure charts are a bit of a pain in the ass because, like, I need the grappling hook, but hidden behind treasure charts are probably some of the best stuff in the game. The one thing I wish would show up in randomizers, and I get why why they don't, but it doesn't mean I don't want them to, is the um thingy, the the light arrows. I can completely understand why they don't do it, but like. One thing I didn't get around to doing on my on my save was the Savage Labyrinth. And I probably will get around to it. But like Yeah. I don't want treasure charts. I want a bow. Realistically, so I can deal with the Battle of the Gales. And then I want a hook, not a hook shot, I want a grappling hook. So I can deal with buried treasure. Then I'm pretty much able to get into anything. Fuck it, we'll do a walker. <clears throat> I don't want to, but we will. This is one of the most tedious things to do in the entire game, and I completely understand. But it's better to get the tedious stuff out of the way while, while we're doing stuff. Come on. Oh, gotta make sure I've got a good grip on my controller. The other reason I want the, um, the grappling hook is because it will make it easier to obtain the items we need to, to progress. Like, the spoils of war we need. Thank <laughs> you. 
I love how fluid sword play felt in the 2000s Zeldas. Every other Zelda feels kind of shit, like when it comes to the sword play. But Wind Waker chose to have a more acrobatic sword play style. A bit more like the Star Wars prequels. And Twilight Princess chose to do sword play in an even better way. Don't get me wrong, sword play in Skyward Sword is great and all, but it's too rigid. It's focused on finding ways to express weak points in a in a more normal way. Okay, keep it simple. But yeah, no, the sword play in Wind Waker is some of the best in the series. And I was saying this to my friend about um, the Gandalf boss fight, boss fight in Wind Waker. You know, Gandalf actually feels like a credible threat because of how um, how well he wields his sword. Don't get me wrong, I like Mage Gandalf in Ocarina of Time, but I prefer. The idea of a Gandalf who's trying to match Link at what he does best, basically. This is just strategy realistically to handle Walker. Just use your shield as much as possible. Don't worry about the power on moves if like a rule. Yeah, sure, do them occasionally, but you can get more done if you don't fuck about that. Okay, so... Come <laughs> on. 
There we go. <sighs> God. I'm pretty sure it's only 500. I'll be annoyed if it turns out there's more. I should probably check that. Uh, yeah. All is good. I should check that one too. And it, even if it hasn't got anything unique. Which reminds me. I need to go and find the shop ship. By Great Fish. That's, um, I should probably pick that up. Again. Again. One more time. Because I want to match up to 10 points. If I can make 5 purchases a time. Then I'll be well on my way to getting the thingy card. Um, okay, so I'm trying to think if there's anything worth doing on this side of things. Okay, so this is where the beauty of things happens. Like we can just sail until we get to the. I let steel. And hopefully nothing goes wrong. Because if it does, I will be very upset. I will be incredibly upset, actually. But... That wouldn't be as simple as just firing all batteries. Exactly what I'd hoped for. Am I seriously going to have to? Yeah, no, I need to go in on, on my own. Awful. Of course, you can find many riches around these parts. I always find it so cool the way this happens. And thank you for that. <laughs> okay, so I can't do Western Fairy Island if I remember rightly. Uh, trying to think of what I can actually do right now.
I've got an idea. I'll do Zunari, I think. Zunari and um, Sploosh Kaboom. Might as well handle Sploosh Kaboom when we're at it. To do Mrs. Mary and the killer bees. Like, while we're here. Honestly, I'll just handle the most tedious stuff, I think. I think that might be the best course of action. Locking Nico in there after I finish. Honestly. I love the pirates. They annoy me to no end, but I do like them. Do Zunari's trading quest. Sploosh kaboom. I will do the auction, just not in this exact second. Okay, I'm gonna need to pull up the probability calculator for this. So, 
Aye, aye, sir. Splish. That would be a miss. Splish. Miss. Splish. Miss. Kaboom. Oh. Hit. Kaboom. Kaboom. Splish. Miss. Kaboom. Kaboom. <laughs> Sploosh. 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 Kaboom. Kaboom. Sploosh. Sploosh. Kaboom. 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 Sploosh. Sploosh. Yep, it's unsolvable. Well, it's not, but I wouldn't have been able to do that in my in that run. Okay. Sploosh. 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 Kaboom. Kaboom. Sploosh. Sploosh. Kaboom. Kaboom. And then that is one dead. Kaboom. Kaboom. Sploosh. Kaboom. 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 Sploosh. 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 And I, I have to get it now. Okay, that is one of the rewards. Treasure chart four. Wonderful. Increment. I don't know what incremental kill. Increment kills is. Okay, so. 20 cannibals. Sploosh. Kaboom. 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 Sploosh. Sploosh. Kaboom. Kaboom. Sploosh. 
Splish. Splish. Okay, um. Splish. 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 Sploosh. 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 I'm getting tired of saying it. Sploosh. Sploosh. Kaboom. Kaboom. Yeah, no, it's unlikely that I'm gonna actually. Splish, splish. <laughs> yeah, that upset me. That really upset me. Um, how long have we been filming for? Nearly an hour. Okay. Yeah, try it again. need to get this if I want to win my problem. Yeah, no, I, I'm fucked. Um, gun bust. I don't like this mini game either, to be honest. Oh, wait, what? That's unusual. I could have sworn it, um, it only gave you the second item if you surpassed the thing. Right, um, either way, not a big deal. We have the picture box now, which means we can do of additional things. Kill the bees now. Yay! Come on. Okay. We'll start with what's his face over here. Look out, Tippa. Look out below. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hmm. 
These guys are little bastards, honestly. No, I'm not nice. Just sit down and think about what you've done. Your ankles should have shattered. I'd have been there to laugh when they did. Okay, the last one. I want to say I've got to go. Here we are. I don't like the killer bees. I prefer the bombers. That's only because I've memorized Clock Town to the maximum ability of a person. You see, having the bombers notebook really does make all the difference. It's one of the reasons why Majora is the best game in the series. School necklace. I need 20 of those for the creepy old guy. exact second. Oh yeah, I need to go and visit um, Maggie. Chart. That actually helps. I can actually make use of that. And I've got the Master Sword, which means I can go and um, handle the beginning of the Forsaken Fortress. Oh my god, I love that. I, I actually love that. Just because I think that bastard deserves to have his pots destroyed. Isn't there a... Yeah, there is. Right, I shall be back in a moment. I shall... I shall deal with that. Thing is, this game basically says that all rich people are snobs, which is true. I find that all people that have money are less tolerable than those that don't. That might that may be because I don't, but you know, um Point Gem release stands. Okay, heart, heart piece. To fill up the next heart container. I'm actually really relieved that we've got the Master Sword. It'll make my life so much easier.
Okay, I need I need the full moon to come out so I can take a picture of it. But that's not really an issue for the time being. Oh yeah, we got Tingle to deal with. I don't really want to help him, but we're going to have to. Come on, out you come. Raging criminal. Yay! <laughs> Those are tingled magic words. Don't steal them. Yeah, I don't want your statue. Marginally more helpful, but still not great. Bastard. The fact that he's a required person to visit in this game. Dingle makes me sick with his scams. incredibly useless to me at this moment in time. Those are the only places I really need them. I picked them up because like why wouldn't I? Alright. Take me home, can't you roads? <laughs> Okay, so... I can't think of anything else I can actually do at this moment in time on the island. Just make sure I haven't been messaged by my friend. Um... Alright, where is it? I love the style of the music on, on that island. I do. Then again, the music in Wind Waker is some of the best of the series. It's got one of the best mini boss themes. It's got the best island, like, it's got the best town themes, I'd say. And all the callbacks to Ocarina of Time. They give me life. Da -da -da, da -da -da. Good came of that. But something good will come up the next bit. There we go. I have one joy pendant. I have. It's not looking great. Submarine.
We are coming to a close of episode one, but like... Not until this is out of the way. Okay. There's another joy coming for me. Another golden feather for me. Leave me alone. Thieving rats. Um... Incredibly long and drawn out quest if you do it the, the way that the game intends. I will not do it the way the game intends just because I can't be asked. I'll just slowly do it. Like as I go along. I'll do up to the magic armor though. I feel like that's fair. Go on, Mum. Come on. Look like fucker. Come on. Okay. I ain't the biggest fan of this area, but we might do with what we've got. I don't like how narrow those pathways are. I prefer to be able to just move as quickly as possible across things. I understand why. But like... But I ain't gonna have any sick. I'm gonna need to. Okay, I need to get this in from over here. That's those. I did that a lot quicker than the last time I did this fucking room. Another school necklace. I think we can finish up to the magic armor. I'm not mean to do that. Um, okay. Um, I 
Yeah, all I need to do now is um is pick up the exotic flower and then go back to Windfall for the time being. I'll handle the rest of it as and when we continue. see what Beetle's got on this shop ship. It won't be anything unique, most likely. But it's always worth a look. Yeah, I know. Arguably it's worse. Because I can't pick up arrows. I've got no bottles either at the minute, which means I can't deal with that. Stuff. Okay. I hadn't meant to do that, just saying. 25 rupees. Exotic flower. I could do the um lighthouse. Yeah, I think I'll do the lighthouse. Wait, I can't. Ignore me. I wonder how do I insist on walking straight past Dunari? Heart piece. Okay, um... So the next, so in the next part, we're going to be finishing the trading quest. I, I was going to do it as we go along, but like, no, I need rid of this shit. Like, I need to get this done with. Um, let me think. So anything else? I may as well. We'll do Spectacle Island before we go. Both times we need to do it. We'll get the blue shoe jelly while we're over there as well. Think I did the normal one? I don't know. I, I've lost track. I've lost track of everything. Um, I believe it's Rocks Bar where. Yeah, it's Roxbar where all the good shit is. We'll go, we'll do Roxbar before we finish as well because I'm gonna forget if I don't.
50 rupees for a shot. Okay. Not far from what I was supposed to be doing. That's going to be more like 35, I think. Yeah. I have a little bit of room for error. Okay. This isn't luck, there actually is skill to this one. And then I need to give it another shot. Think it's fifty? No. There we go. Heart pieces. Right, rock fire. Rock fire, then we're done. Okay. Oh, we also need to do Mother and Child Islands. That's the thing I forgot. That's the one. Um. Yikes. Uh. We could actually do actual rock spire as well, to be fair, if we wanted to. However, we've been playing for an hour and a half, and I don't like having like really long videos saved to my hard drive by my SSD. Same difference in this case. Yeah, but it's definitely this one because the ship's covered up. You know why that makes it seem more mysterious. That's the other reason we're not doing the whole trading quest. Exactly. It. Ooh, hammer. Bye. Actually. to justify it. Okay. Because I actually don't need red chew jelly at all to my knowledge. I will double check that, but like as far as I'm aware I have absolutely no use for it. Uh, was the thingy over here? Okay. 
Nah. Okay. I actually think I might have fucked up there by doing it with the can. Because they're supposed to drop rupees. And I'll have missed them now because of that. Um kind of hoping that the reward for this area is money so I can get the steel hammer at least we know where it is to be fair like I'll go ages without knowing where the fuck something is okay no I was actually hoping that that would I'm a dipshit. Actually, I should take a look at the moon and make sure that it's... Yeah. Okay, um... Mother and Child. I'd say. Wait, do I have? No, I don't. I can't get into the private oasis like this then. Um. Because in my old rando version settings, um, I usually just set the private oasis deed to being in my inventory by default. I know how I'll end off. I know exactly how to end off. Um, I keep adding more things to my to-do list, but like, this is mostly because I will actually forget if I don't. I've got I've got thirty bombs. As long as I'm not stupid with them, I should be okay to do this because there's not much to this. Um, Yeah, okay. Um, that's actually a very, very good point. Um, see what's over here first, because it doesn't look like it's one of the shooty platforms. Yeah, it's this one. I like this platform, to be fair. It's all pure combat challenge. At least let me come up so I can fight you, like, like, properly. Rifle shot. 
yeah, those coming through sooner rather than later would be much appreciated, to be honest. I don't really want to wait for them. I always re-roll before I get to the end of a rando, is the thing. You get to the point where you just don't have any items coming through anymore. Oh, great fairy. <laughs> I've been my quest then. In the home of the earth you will find an item, a purple map which may help you on your quest. That's not helpful. I don't want a purple map. Tell me where I can find the bow or some shit. Okay. That's enough now. Okay, so... Consider this a new series. I don't know when I'm going to be streaming the rest of Metroid Dread, but I think I might start Majora on stream before I um, even bother. Because, to be honest, I'm not really in the mood for Dread at the minute. I left it too many days, I think. We'll see. We'll, we'll see where we're at. But I am streaming Majora soon. With the um, N64 controller for the Switch. Which is somewhere around me, and I'll have to find that before I do. But anyway, have a good day, and I will see you guys next time. I'll probably be filming more of this soon. Okay, bye.